Peace be with you. A happy sunny Wednesday morning. Friends, tomorrow morning we'll begin a festive celebration of the 50th anniversary of celebrating, of establishing STM. So for all of us, the day will start with a school-wide mass at 9.30 in our gym. So let us continue to give thanks and gratitude for the past 50 years of shaping the mind, body and souls of young people and for a place where so many staff have built a community for Catholic education. Also today, we celebrate the National Administrative Professionals Day, commonly known as the Secretary's Day. So the day uh, when we recognize the work of secretaries, administrative assistants, receptionists, and other administrative support professionals. So perhaps today let us be especially kind to the uh, main office and the other places in our building. And great for the gift of life and for those who work in our school offices, let us begin in the name of the Father, of the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Gracious God, giver of, go of all good gifts, we praise you and thank you for the many blessings you have bestowed upon St. Thomas More School during the past 50 years. Send your Holy Spirit to guide, protect, and help us to grow in our education, our physical fitness, and spiritual maturity. May every person who enters this place know that Jesus Christ is the reason for this school. Inspire and support us to follow the example of our patron, St. Thomas More, who lived his life with unwavering faith, courage, and love for you. Grant us the strength to always live out his final words, that I am the King good servant, but God's first. In union with Mary, Queen of the world, and St. Joseph, the patron of Canada, we humbly ask to guide us in our journey of faith and education. Through Christ our Lord, amen. Our Lady of Good Counsel, pray for us. St. Thomas More, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, amen. So yes, I'm staying on, just uh, please uh, sit down, or if you're on the hallway, just you can give me couple of seconds of your attention because that's pretty much the last time I have the opportunity to address all of you before Sunday, that is before the walk or the pilgrimage. Uh, I'll remind you again at the end of the day and tomorrow for those who will be here. But uh, as thank you all, first of all to all, to all who took the, the form and decided to participate in this board-wide fundraiser that will take place on Sunday, uh, this Sunday. Uh, for those of you who will be who are coming, please come to school uh, for 9:30 in front of the cafeteria. There will be three buses waiting for us. Each one of them will take a group of people, and you are divided in an alphabetical order. So look for a folder or a sign, something like this, with letters that you're the first letter of your last name, and that's the bus you will go on it. Okay, so if you can't find your last name, there may be a spelling mistake or something, so please come see me. And those buses will take us down to the Cathedral uh, High School for Mass that starts at 11. After Mass, we'll uh, walk up the hill to St. Anthony Daniels. There, the walk ends with a little reception or a slice of pizza and back on the buses and back to school. Perhaps uh, by 3 o'clock, we should be back here. Now, please also keep uh, your eyes open or uh, attend uh, uh, gosh, uh, focus on, on the board side in case of any cancellation. Uh, the weather can uh, be not too favorable. It happened in the past that the walk was canceled or something else took place. Regardless, I look forward to seeing all those of you who signed up. And if there's any questions, please come and see me. Thank you so much and have a blessed day, everyone. Hey STM, my name is Maria and I'm here from United Against Racism. UAR is back with our open discussions. 
This week, join UAR to discuss cultural genocide within Western society. We have some amazing guest speakers lined up for you from our grade 12 genocide class. And all are welcome to participate, both students and staff, and even if you aren't a UAR member. This discussion will be held in the lecture hall today after school. See you then. Had cancer? Think about it. Everyone has a connection to cancer, even you. The Canadian Cancer Society's Relay for Life is a chance for us to celebrate cancer survivors, remember those we've lost, and join your community to fight back against cancer. And whether we're walking east or west, north or south, we're all moving in the same direction so that one day we won't have to think about cancer. We can just think about Anne. Register today at cancer.ca slash relay. Every step you take will help save lives. Remember when Anne... Good morning, STM. My name is Sarah. And I'm Claire. And we're here from Unites Fighting Cancer. STM, we are hosting our own Real Life for Life walk outside on our track and turf field on Friday, May 26th from periods 2 to 5. Staff mm -hmm. and students are invited to participate by registering online and fundraising a minimum of $20 per person. We encourage you to register as a team as it will be helpful for the relay and games we have planned, but individuals are welcome too. A minimum $20 will get you a t-shirt, food, and a fun day outside walking for a great cause. Those who fundraise the most per team and per person will win great prizes. See at STM KFC or a KFC community member for more details on how to register. It's going to be a great, day, great relay, STM. Hi, STM. My name is Claire. And my name is Delina. And these are your announcements for today. This message is from your prefect with your academic tip of the week. Procrastination happens, but don't let it take over your life. Pay attention to what makes you procrastinate and try to avoid these triggers, especially during high stress times. This is also a reminder that pre prefect tutoring will take place today in soon success during your lunch. A reminder to all track members that they are to arrive at McMaster University at 8.45 a.m. tomorrow morning. Plan on staying the entire day. Would all members of the STM Ultimate Frisbee team please see Mr. Castellani today regarding upcoming tournament information and the team spirit wear ordering information. Members are also reminded that there is a practice Thursday after school on the side field. Students with any questions or who are unable to attend practice should see a coach ASAP. Just a reminder that lunch lounge will be taking place today in room 156 during periods 3 and 4. Attention all neuroscience members, today is our last regular meeting before the McMaster Brain Bee this Friday. Anyone who has not yet presented their chapter presentations will be given the opportunity to present them at today's meeting. If you're planning on attending the McMaster Brain Bee on Friday, make sure to get a trip form from Miss Newberry in room 333 or in the science office. And now for your sports. Yesterday, the senior girls soccer team played their third regular season game against VR. The girls won with a score of 2-1 thanks to goals scored by Janelle Silvestri and Samantha DeStephanis. Thanks, thanks STM. STM. STM, happy National Clerical Workers Day. This is a message for all clerical workers. You are officially the unsung heroes of the office. Thank you for juggling our schedules, organizing our chaos, and keeping us on track. Without you, we'd be lost in a sea of paperwork and typos. You're the real MVPs. Keep calm and clerical work on. STM, those are all of your announcements. The time is now 8.22. And remember, it's a great day to be a knight.